Okay, now we are. Um, yeah, like I say, I'll try to get this, uh, get, get some kind of a guided reading list up for, for everybody. And again, as I say, before the day is out. So Catherine, Kathleen, Kathy to everyone must go. See you next week. Bye bye. Bye, bye Kathy. <laughs> bye, Kathy. Um, oh, and I think you made note, Susan, that the um, the fourth is it, is, it, is it the fourth episode of the second season of The Chosen is premiering tonight. Denise actually said it a couple weeks ago. So we kept looking, kept looking, and it wasn't there. Um, and yeah. Denise did send that, I guess it's premiering tonight. So yeah. we are excited because we thought, well, maybe we're doing something wrong. And I eventually I was going to ask you about that. So yeah, yeah. Because I, I was wondering too when the fourth one was going to come. But. What channel is it on? Is it on a channel? It, it, no, it's not on a channel. It, it, uh, it is live on YouTube on the Chosen channel, but it's what they're trying to do is get uh, uh, get everybody to focus onto the the app, whether it's uh, uh, on a on a phone or a tablet. Uh, what they're really trying to do is to is to get you to access it by their app, and then uh, you can stream it to your TV uh, through something okay. like Apple TV or Roku or uh, Amazon. Uh, what is it? Uh, there's a Google TV thing too. But that uh, that's you know they're they're really aiming at a very very broad. Um, international audience and and I, I think they're right that it is uh, the best way to get it out internationally is and, and, and you know I'm, I've, I've got one of the I'm not well she's not on now but she probably was uh, you may have run across the name Nyla Nyla Yunus uh, she is a woman in a in a moderately small town in Pakistan who is working in the health services for the government. She's Christian and she's been following my stuff devotedly since last year. Hmm. Uh, all she has is a smartphone, an Android smartphone. Now she would be able to get this app hmm. uh, and that would be the only way that she'd be able to get it, hmm. uh, get the chosen. And they're, you know, they're getting stuff from uh, all over the world. Uh, people, you know, writing in and saying how impressed they are with the chosen. And apparently now, because they've gotten the kind of support that they really want and need, they're able to make these available free uh, for the first. Uh, for the first season, I think they were, okay, Susan's iPad has entered the waiting room. We're going to see two of Susan now. Um, <laughs> there's both, there's both Susan. Sorry about that. Phone call come in while, while Zooming with you. I didn't know that was possible. So I had a, it'd be best for me to put it onto the iPad because I did have a call come in for a meeting yeah. that I'm having, so yeah. my fault. Yeah. So anyway, you um, can you can go to uh, thechosen.tv. That will give you their website. Okay. And I think okay. you can watch it in the computer on, on a browser on their website, um, as okay. well as um, get the instructions to to download their app which is free and it's very easy okay yeah
Yeah, yeah right. I mean, I don't want to watch it on my phone. So, I mean, it's better to watch it. I have a couple of computers. I've got a, um, a Chrome Chromebook, which has a bigger screen than, mm -hmm. than my PC. So, mm -hmm. you know, I don't care about watching it on my TV because I've got an, I watch it enough. So mm -hmm. I just sort of do, you know, watch movies, Netflix on my in bed mm -hmm. <laughs> when I'm trying to go to sleep at night. It's addictive. Yeah. Born her, it's very addictive. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She watched the whole thing in what did she say? One day, two days? I think yeah. it's in the whole thing days. Well, one of one of their one of their early slogans when the fir first season was completed was binge Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> and Denise followed that to the T, yes. <laughs> yeah. And then so we slowly followed to we didn't have um, yes, we did it in increments and then we started binging bigger and bigger. So it was uh, addictive. Yeah. yeah. What they also recently uh, put out is a, um, is a, uh, a, a Bible study guide to the first season. Right, mm. right. Mm. And uh, uh, that, that, that's kind of interesting. You know, it, it, it's one of these kind of wide ranging things that there is there is some kind of inspiration of the Holy Spirit behind this. I'm I'm fairly fairly well convinced. It it is such a unique way of looking at everything that I mean going to parochial school twelve years. Uh, I mean it's just such a different way of looking at so many yeah. aspects. Of what the possibility of how it, it could have been, uh, which is just um, and then also the sense of humor and the quick wit and all that is just. Uh, very, very uh, attractive to Mike and I, and for Mike to stay awake long enough to catch some of this, it's um, it's saying something. <laughs> I mean, he's up at three thirty, going out of the house at four a.m. So yeah, for him to stay up a little bit to catch some of this is something. My goodness. <laughs> and Jan, you may remember uh, from Good Shepherd, Jonathan Rumi. Uh huh. Sure. Sure. Yeah. I think uh, he's still there. I mean, I. Yeah, you know, he is. Since he since but, we've been, you know, not, I mean, we just started coming back in person, but then I don't drive in every Sunday because it's just traffic is starting to get heavy again, as you know. Yeah. So. But, uh, uh, and of course, Jonathan now has a fairly active schedule because he's playing Jesus. Yeah, right, right. So, uh, and I've always, I've always felt he, w his, his whole personality and his appearance, you know, made him the quintessential Jesus. Totally, totally. Yeah. Well, remember we went to that one screening of, I think early on they were, you know, they did a screening of one episode at the church. Right, right, they did. And that, yeah. uh, that was got to be a couple of years ago for sure. Yeah, I think it was two years ago. So. If you ever do a wine and cheese soiree with him, I, 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 I'll bring some bottles. I, I, I would love to, you know, go. <laughs> okay. That sounds good. Well, <laughs> I got to go. Okay. So actually I'm getting a little hungry. Done too, so. I'm hoping it was okay to invite Paul into the, uh, in the comment section, Paul from the temple. Cause I thought, you know, this would be really interesting to see his take on yeah, this whole this whole conversation, which I think is intriguing. Uh, that might be very good. That might put me back in touch with Paul. So where is he in the in the comment comment comic comment section? You said in the, on the threads uh, before I came on live, um, I was sharing and I made a couple comments as I was setting things up out here. Uh, and one of them was uh, I, I tagged Paul. I believe I tagged Paul on one of the comments oh. saying your thoughts on this or something to that effect this discussion oh, so okay. pull him into a little bit of because i'm thinking you know this whole conversation is about jesus being jewish and the jewish discussion i thought it'd be intriguing to get his take it it would be it would be uh, it, it, it might be interesting to have him have him on this online well we'll see what happens over the coming week this sounds exciting manja manja Yes, I, 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 I do need to keep body and soul together. Take care. Okay. Okay. Well, God bless you all, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll, be, we'll stay in touch. Definitely. Okay. Have a good week. Bye. Bye. Bye.